got some music for you guys here on Living 808. Here to tell us all about Hawaiian Falsetto Volume 1. We bring in our friend Daryl to Living 808. What's going on, Daryl? How are you? So, uh, Festivals of Aloha features one of our biggest premier events. Um, it's the Richard Hopi Falsetto Contest. Right. And this year we celebrated 20 years. And so, for 20 years, we released a compilation album featuring some of our past champions and some of the judges that kind of guest spotted and jumped in too. So we have one of our former judges, Kalani Pe'a's on here, Love Cody Poyo Pata, and of course we even have a song from Uncle Richard himself. Even though he's he has passed, we were able to um, receive the rights to share one of his classic me um, mele, which is Ohu Ohu Kakuloa. Mm -hmm. He's totally known for it, so yeah. I love that. You know what, let, let's pay a little homage to Uncle Richard real quick. Um, I want to know, as far as a musician-wise, you know, artist, what is something that you look up to when it comes to Uncle Richard? Uncle was always polished. Like, even when he was more his lawn in Kakuloa, you could see him as you drove yeah. through, and he always had his hair done and his shirt. Even though it was a t-shirt, it was pressed. Yep. And so he expects that out of the com the competitors that come to compete in his contest, because you are to emulate the kind of musician that he was. Uh, you know, he's a, a treasure for us here on Maui, and so we want to make sure that all of the people that are champions emulate that. And so he was always polished. I love that. I yeah. love that. You know, so you're paying homage to Uncle Richard, which we love. Um, we also are excited because this is three years in the making. Three years in the making. It here was we a are. COVID baby. And <laughs> then, you know, here we are 20 years of this falsetto contest. And we wanted to do something big for that. Right. And so now we're able to get everybody who was a champion after 2008 to record um, and have an opportunity to be on a compilation. So. Right. Yeah. Super exciting. Um, you know, we were even mentioning um, that there's a good website or social media account um, that sh people should follow uh, because, like we said, this is volume one. So there's going to be a lot of projects that a lot of people can look coming forward to. Coming out to. And big shout out to Haku Collective, yes. Haku Records yeah. for coming in and really helping us to handle the legal business. And like the music industry is so different now. Right. Like I've, got, I've heard stories where they're in their kitchen, you know, and it's quiet and crazy and you don't even know what's in the background. And today it's so fast to mm -hmm. just release your music, put it out there. And we're doing it right by partnering with them. So I want to shout out yes. to... Kimmy Miner and her whole team at Haku Collective for really yeah. helping us to bring this vision to life. And of course, the real like magic um, engineer behind this is um, Mr. Wailao Ryder and Mikey. Um, you guys did, Kasil, you guys have been so amazing. Mikey Kasil, Mahalo Nui for making all the magic happen for us. Um, because this album is truly beautiful. I'm not just saying that because I'm a part of it, but you guys are gonna wanna play this over and over again. <laughs> it's like the best compilation. Yes. Yes. And, and speaking of the best, you know, Haku Collective, Living 808 has worked with them for a little bit. Real quick, before we end the segment, and we'll give you guys a preview of what you guys can expect in a little bit, I want to know about your thoughts when it comes to the evolution of Hawaiian music. Even though this was three years in the making, this is 20 years of hard work built into one album, um, I want to know your thoughts on the evolution of Hawaiian music from where it was to where it is today. Well, like I mentioned, it's so fast, you know, and um, now because of that, people who wouldn't necessarily record can release now. And so we're hearing, you know, the wide array of what Hawaiian music is. And, and I've always believed this too, um, is that Hawaiian music is not just one genre. It's like this whole, you know, huge thing. And that's why at the Hoku, there's so many categories, right? And we right. honor all of them. But Hawaiian music for us in this, project, it's Hawaiian falsetto. And so you're going to get to hear the different kinds of Hawaiian falsetto. Great. Like there's so many different, you know, variations, sounds, and everybody has their unique voice in this and you're going to get to hear it. So. Perfect. And if anybody wanted to stay updated with you about your projects, what's that website? That Please go to, to festivalsofaloha.com and we're on all our socials as well. All the proceeds from this album go right back into Festivals of Aloha and putting on Uncle Richard's falsetto contest. So please join us and um, pick up an album or download it today. All right, everybody, it's festivalsofaloha.com. Log on right after the show. You'll find all the up-to-date information on that website. Brother Darrell, thank you so much for coming on to Living no, 808. thank you for having me. All right, everybody, stay with us because in a little bit, we're going to have some music for you all. Who do we have for everybody? We have our current champion from the Uncle Richard's Falsetto Contest. His name is Heua Olu Saidurua. You guys are going to love his voice. But that's more music, more everything to come in, you know, for future compilations to come. So enjoy. Perfect. Thanks, Daryl.